Hey guys, it's Amy. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very special unboxing. It is my first time where I purchased from MatchesFashion.com. Matches Fashion is one of those uh, online luxury retailers that sell basically a variety of high-end designer items from shoes to clothing to handbags etc. As you can tell by the title, it is a Gucci unboxing. It comes in this box so what I did is I just removed the delivery box so I haven't looked at it yet. This is a true unboxing and I'm super excited. Okay so it opens like so. Let me just open it and it says matchesfashion.com and it comes with some documentation. This is my first time looking at it at the same time as you. So here it says uh, matches fashion. It was carefully packaged by Linda. And then here I have, I guess I have receipts out oh, there. There's receipts and instructions on how to return your items. By the way, they are based in London, but uh, there's a bunch of them that are, you know, all over Europe. I think Luisa Vioroma is from Italy and then in Canada we have census.com and I'm sure there's a bunch of them net portée So here you go. I'm opening the paper wrapping So exciting and here you go. It says Gucci it comes in this nice dust bag. Let's see if there's anything underneath this Looks like that's it. This is just padding So that is it. So I, you have the option to choose two kinds of packaging. You can choose uh, one of their beautiful boxes like this, which I opted to do because I've never ordered from them and I really wanted to see for myself uh, the packaging, uh, how it looks like. And it's a beautiful box actually, I really like it. Um, and then here is the item. So are you guys ready? Let me just unbox it and then I'll tell you guys why I ordered it and my thought process. So here's the dust bag. And as you can see, peeking out, it looks like it's a double GG. And yes, it is. This is the Marmont in the velvet. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. I have to tell you guys why I picked this and how I ended up deciding for another flat bag seems well packaged all the chains are all well insulated from the velvet there's some stuffing in there and there's uh some documentations what is this uh, a piece of the material there's some care cards in different languages a responsibility card okay I've seen those <laughs> before and here you go wow and it comes with the matchesfashion.com uh, I guess tag that is uh, just looped around the chain here wow okay let me just take a look and see if it's uh, in good condition The way to open this bag, it seems really really tucked in there but anyway there's like a little push button on the bottom and you just push it. Uh, so yeah basically it's this little button right there, you push it and then uh, it will re release the, uh, the locking mechanism. And there's a little tab here that says Gucci with a number and uh, there is a leather tab that says Gucci made in Italy. That's the one that is on the slip pocket here. Is this scuffing? Let me see. Or is this just the way it is because it's the corner? I'll really have to examine all the corners and see that uh, if the velvet has been damaged through manufacturing or something. Although it doesn't really bother me that much. I'll just have to make sure when, uh, when I'm off camera. But yeah, it looks... Maybe it is just the corner because they do have to go through with the stitch through all the sides. The strap is leather. 
I do like that this style has a slightly different style of, of chain strap because it's different from all the other bags that I have. This is the velvet version. It also comes in leather version. This is the mini size. There is a super mini and there's a small and medium. It looks really, really spacious, more so than the minis from Chanel. The reason why I decided to try to order from Matches Fashion, there's two folds. Uh, first of all, this bag is just sold out in my store and I think in order to order one, they told me that it would be a two month wait, which I thought it was ridiculous because I really wanted to see it and I really wanted to, you know, try it and just uh, see if it works out for me and if I love it. And the other reason is because it's actually a lot cheaper to order from Matches Fashion because uh, they are based in the UK and when you purchase from overseas especially in europe they are able to deduct the vat and then of course you have to pay duties and all that but what's good about matches fashion and i did look at and compare at several of those online retailers uh is that um they also help you deduct the duties and taxes for your country so when you receive your package everything is paid for you don't need to worry about extra custom or surprises which i really really love and the price end up basically being the retail price in Canada but without the taxes so I've basically saved about 12% on this bag and I got it right away it took them like I don't know when did I order it I ordered it on so today's Thursday and I ordered it on Sunday it literally took them took them four days to ship from London all the way here which is amazing and I don't know judging from just like this initial unboxing I love it I'm not seeing any flaws but I'm just gonna make sure after I turn off the camera that um, everything is indeed okay before I remove this I don't want to you know I don't want to just take off all the packaging and the tags before I'm sure that I'm keeping it although I'm pretty sure I will keep it because it looks gorgeous and um, so yeah I decided to go for a velvet bag because I don't have a velvet bag and also I know I'm already you know I already have so many mini bags I have two Chanel minis at this point and then I have some more casual smaller bags such as my twice and my Palm Springs backpack but this is just so different and to be honest I was never a fan of the Marmont Gucci bag uh, as I said before however for the velvet version it's a different story because for some reason the velvet is just so much more luxurious when I look at it and it takes colors so so well and yes I did not really want another black bag or another dark color bag I actually really wanted the color that's called Rubin hello Mel if you're watching the color that she has the the purplish burgundy color it's just sold out it's not even available anywhere in this size I didn't want to go with a small size which is basically the size of a jumbo classic flap I typically really love carrying small bags and I don't really mind rotating between all my small bags so I think this is perfect for a you know great night out and or even just worn casually I think I'm gonna have so much fun uh, styling this because it has this very different chain which is chunkier, a little bit more edgy but the velvet also makes it so luxurious and so sort of you know romantic I'll insert some modeling shots so that you guys can see how it looks like styled uh, I think this will go super well with almost any outfit t-shirt, jeans, leather jacket, a really nice dress um, I don't know, a nice blazer especially in the darker shades I don't know, I think it's just so luxurious and yes, I know that some people are worried about uh, the wear and tear of velvet and also um, just the lint getting all over it it's okay, I think I can probably roll it away for the lint and as far as wear and tear um, I heard that as long as you're not really using this bag on a daily basis then it's fine which is basically what I intended to do. It's not gonna be my everyday bag. I do have enough small bags to ro rotate with, so I think that's okay. So yeah, I'm so glad that I got it and hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll definitely make an update video with uh, what fits inside and such and my thoughts on the pros and cons uh, maybe in a few weeks. <laughs> Just remind me if I forget. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're new, welcome to my channel and I hope that you subscribe because I do make at least one video every week on Monday but I do often post several ones throughout the week. 
And I guess that is it. I hope you guys are doing well and I will talk to you again very soon. Bye.